to another Miss Trenny Treats. This Friday, The Secret Life of Pets will be released. It's been advertising for a while now, and I love the previews. I cannot wait to see the movie. So I'm going to be making four different pets all from the movie. Luke the dog, Snowball the bunny, Max the dog, and Chloe the cat. So, without further ado, let's get started. So first what we're going to do is we're going to take out your decorating bag and you're going to drop in your coupler. This end of the coupler goes into the bag and press it all the way till it hits the opening and then you take your tip with this part of the, the second part of the coupler, you put it over the top of the tip and you twist it on. Now we're going to take our chocolate frosting and we are going to scoop it out and stick it inside the bag. your bag you're going to want to go over your cupcake and just drop just little spots all around the cupcake trying to make sure that you overlap just a little bit so that the frosting looks like hair and there's no gaps in the middle really good his hair is nice and shaggy and so next what we're going to do is we're going to add his eyeballs this is my eyeball bag and all the eyeballs I have are just that little black dots in the center and I need for this dude I'm going to need brown eyes Duke has brown eyes so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take one of these eyes I'm gonna flip it on its back and I'm going to take a Tootsie Roll flatten it down and place it in the center to make his eyes brown. Squish my Tootsie Roll down. What I'm going to do is I'm taking this tip number three and I'm going to use the end of it, the opening, and I'm going to press it into my Tootsie Roll to make the browns of his eyes. He's looking really cute. I've got his eyes done and now what we're going to do is we're going to make his nose and we're going to use a black jelly bean. And for his tongue we're going to use a pink starburst and what I'm going to do is I'm just going to smush it up a little bit to make it a little bit easier to roll. So then what I'm going to do is I'm going to roll it out, I'm going to take a little piece off the corner and then mold it into the size of the tongue that he needs and place it on his face. Now for his ears, we are going to use a Tootsie Roll and we're just going to squeeze it squish it until it's pliable then we can roll it out with our rolling pin or fondant roller and we are going to make his ears same bag with chocolate in tip number 233, I'm going to go over the Tootsie Rolls to make them look hairy like the rest of his head. It's done. We're going to move on to the next one. Okay, so now the next one we're going to make is Snowball the Insane Bunny some white icing on the top of his cupcake. I'm going to take a 
regular sized marshmallow and we're just going to cut it in half and then I'm going to cut it in half again because I want to make his ears standing straight up if I can. Okay, so now with my uh, little bowl of pink sprinkles, I'm going to carefully dip both sides of his ears in the sprinkles and then place it on his head. For his eyes, he has these big blue eyes, but I'm gonna make his, um, and I wanna make his face the doughy eye face, like he's looking up kind of, you know, all innocent. So that's the bunny we're gonna make today. I'm gonna use the jelly bean, but because this one's way too big, I'm going to just trim off the end and mold it a little bit just to clean up the edges and pop it in his face. And there is Snowball. He's so cute. We're going to have to put him aside and we'll start on the next one. And now we're going to do Max. Max has a white base so and we're going to use Tootsie Roll to make his brown spots in his ears. Now for Max's nose and his eyebrows. Uh, there's Max, and so let's move on to Chloe. For Chloe, we have to make, we're gonna have to color our white frost in gray with a couple drops of black food coloring. Actually, I'm gonna do one drop to start. and gray, we're going to add it uh, a nice smooth layer on to the cupcake. Pink frosting fitted with tip number 352, I am going to pipe on two ears on either side of her head. With her eyes, I'm just going to take the candy eyes I already have. They already have the black, big black pupil in the center, and I'm just going to use my blue edible marker and draw a blue line around the outside and then adhere it to her face. I'm just going to take my gray icing and a toothpick and I'm just going to put a little bit of my icing on the toothpick and spread it over her eyes to give her that sly look. Take my decorating bag and my other coupler and I'm just going to drop that in. And, and using my tip number 12, I'm going to screw the tip onto my bag, onto the coupler, and then fill my bag with white frosting. So now what we're going to do is we're going to add the nose of Chloe onto the front underneath her eyes. I'm going to do what we did before and cut the tip off the jelly bean and put it on Chloe's nose. Shop Chloe, we're going to take our black decorating icing fitted with tip number two and we're going to draw on her mouth.
Thank you so much for joining me. I had so much fun making these guys. I can't wait to see the movie. Let me know what you think below. And until next time, thank you for watching Miss Trenny Treats. Bye-bye. Duke, I want to call him Duffy. Thank you for watching Miss Treading Treats. Bye-bye. Hey guys, I'm Miss C and welcome to another Miss Treading Treats. <laughs> oh. I will be baking. No, I don't want to do it like that. <laughs> um, I can't wait to see.